Yeah. Welcome, friends. Uh, today we are going to discuss about the make file. Uh, what is the purpose of the make file? What is the difference between the make file and the make command? And how we can write the make files? Uh, we'll just see the, all these things with the help of demonstrate with the help of an example. First, let me explain you. We have two folder. One is the SRC folder that contains source source files. And another one is the header fol uh, header folder that we are placing the dot h files header files. So let let me just explain you uh, what exactly I am just putting inside the header folder. I am just creating. Uh, I already create a first dot h header file, and uh, inside the header file we have a function. Void sum. Let me just change this to int sum. Uh, basically, this is the prototype of the function uh, that uh, it will bring two arguments and returning the end value. Okay, that's fine. And uh, again, now we'll just uh, come outside the folder, a header folder, and just see what uh, how many files we are getting in the SRC folder. In SRC folder, we have the two files. First one is the first dot c. Here we have change this void point, and I am just going to returning the sum whatever calculated here. It's a return stamp that is the sum, and uh, another one is the main file that is our main ex uh, main executor. Uh, this is the main file from execution of the program starts because the main is defined in this file where where the main is defined. That is our main executable file. So here, what we have to do, we need to print some print percent is d plus percent is d is the sum of the two numbers is equal to percent is d, and the finally we will go the sum and this going to closing this file. What happens? We have the two variables a. A and the B and the sum. Okay. Now we'll just uh, receive the sum. It will uh, the sum function will return an integer value, and we'll just printing that integer value. That's fine. So now we are closing this example. Before starting the make file, let me just explain what exactly the how, now. Let me just explain you what happens in the project. Inside the project, you have several files. Multiple files, one file, two file, three file, and up to thousand files. Now we want to compile all these files. How we can do that? For compilation, for automatic compilation, we need to define a set of rules. Set of rules inside a file, and that file is known as the make file. So we are just going. To create a make file at the top of our uh, project, for, to our project folder, we are just create make file. We, uh, user can put the comments. Whatever the comments, uh, it's a make file. Make file. And after it, what happens? We have the main. Main is our executable. We just uh, what we are writing. We will just want to generate a my main. This is the name of executable file, and my main is depending on first src first dot o and src main dot o. Okay, and after that we create my main from src first dot o and src main dot o. Now we need to write rules for first and the main dot o. src first dot o src Is depending on first dot c, so gcc hyphen c it will generate an object file from src first dot c. 
again src main dot o will depending on src main dot c now gcc hyphen c src main dot c okay friends what we are doing here we have we want to generate a main file from first dot c and main dot c so my main file is depending on first dot o and first dot c one more thing let me just explain you we are carrying here we are including here header file so we'll just write here hyphen i header we're just writing here header hyphen i header okay that's we we'll complete our main file now we'll just compile this and uh, okay we get put some errors so error is uh, i am just writing here so oh, it's my fault basically i just want to generate this it's a typo mistake i'll do here uh, we want to generate these executable files in a current folder so we just writing this and writing here make again it's telling okay basically we are just defining here first dot i'm just writing this main okay this one start dot o and then r f we'll execute this main command this is make is a utility that is by default available with the linux if any system don't have this make command so in that case user need to be installed via rpm or via yum uh, repository uh, whatever the uh, whatever the operating system that you are whatever the flavor of the linux that you are using you need to uh, install yum install make so first you need to install uh, you, you should know how to configure the yum so in that case you can execute that command so in the by default uh, the command will be available in your system so you will execute the main and uh, this is the uh, all about the main and we'll for the deep dive i will just uh, show you in next videos so thanks for friends thanks for watching